Hello travelers, uh, I am here at K-Pot. This is a Korean barbecue and hot pot place. So it's basically an all you can eat. So you can choose either barbecue, hot pot, or both. And basically they have the stove right here. So they have, this is the stove where you cook some of the meats and vegetables. And this is uh, another part of the stove where you have your hot pot. So yeah, and there's also a little guide right here to show you how long to cook uh, certain meats and veggies for. So yeah, <laughs> let's try it out. Well, just ordered our meats and veggies for the hot pot, which they brought our broths. I got mushroom. And you know that? Uh, I got Japanese miso. Miso. And I also ordered a French fruit tea. I don't know what this is. It's a peach fruit tea. Yeah. It's milky looking though. Are there, are there teas like a milky tea? I think I think so. Oh. I like those milk teas. Oh, oh I hope I like it. Okay, I'm gonna taste this peach. It's peach fruit tea. It's weird. It's weird. But I like it. But you like it? <laughs> because it's sweet, not sugar. <laughs> I like sugar. Thank you. It's different. It's different. I like it though. Yeah. Yeah. All right, here's the buffet. They have some chicken wings, some like little nuggets, spring rolls, plantains, french fries, crab wagon, veggie and rice, crawfish, some pastries, assorted fruit, and some vegetables and salads. Kimchi, oysters, and then over here is the sauce bar with different sauces. Okay, they brought us our veggies for our hot pot. I got corn, spinach, bean sprouts, and udon noodle. And Noel got ramen and mushrooms. And then she's also cooking up her veggies and pineapple on the grill. They also have a buffet, and I got plantains. Crab rangoons, spring roll, and some kind of like nuggets, chicken nuggets. <laughs> now our meats are here. There's a lot going on here. I'm so confused. I had my chicken. I know I got pine biscuit. Oh, this is a lot. They keep bringing stuff out. Yeah, but we bring stuff out. You're trying to eat, but then you have to cook your food. It's crazy. I don't even know if any of this is going to be good. <laughs> I don't know until I try it. I've never done any of this before. It's very overwhelming. I don't see my noodles. They all like sunk to the bottom. They're big noodles. Yeah, they're like heavy noodles because they just like yeah. to the bottom.
<laughs> All right. It was really hard to get it out of the pot and into this tiny bowl. And then they give you this huge spoon, and that's what you're supposed to eat it with. I'm um, waiting to see Noelle eat it with a big spoon. Uh, you can eat it with chopsticks. Oh, never mind. She's going to use chopsticks. I, on the other hand, cannot use chopsticks. Yeah, you can get a smaller spoon. <laughs> but they gave you some big spoons. It's, it's kind of like, you kind of have to do it like this in order to easily get the noodles. It'll be hard. Oh. We're going to have some technical difficulties on my side of the table. <laughs> Let's see Noelle do it, though. Oh, yeah, that looks fun. Garlic scallops that Noelle grilled up for me. <laughs> I did my best. They have a nice char, Noelle. Oh, okay. They're not rubbery, though. They're good. Yeah. Kudos to the chef. <laughs> Alright, so I got a peanut sauce and the K hot sauce because I figured that's their own original sauce. And now Noelle's going to be grilling up some vegetables and some prime brisket. Oh, and sweet potatoes. I like sweet potatoes. Prime brisket is done. Yum. All right, I tried the peanut sauce and it tastes like peanut butter. The K-pot sauce is kind of sweet. It's interesting. It has a little bit of a soy flavor to it, but I like it. And um, Noelle's still cooking these vegetables. Uh, the sweet potatoes? We're, we're not sure about these sweet potatoes. They're not, really They're not cooking. The mushrooms. the mushrooms are cooking. But the sweet potatoes, I think, are going to be a no go. Yeah, they don't cook. <laughs> they, yeah. Very long we'll be here all night. <laughs> Noelle likes a hot pot. I was not a fan. But, you know, it could be. I've never done this before, so I didn't know what to put in this. I didn't know what would work and what wouldn't work or what I would like until you just start. Mixing stuff up and throwing it in there. And I have a hard time eating soups, so it wasn't for me. But I did like I do like the barbecue. These are oyster mushrooms. They're kind of sweet. Never had them before. They're interesting. Alright, the whale's picking up some pork belly now. We ordered some more pineapple, but we think they forgot it. Oh well. It's gonna smell like bacon in here real soon. And my pork belly. And the Wells pork belly. We're just waiting on some pineapple. We wanted pork and pineapple with some sweet and spicy sauce. Uh, I have to say kudos to my chef, Noelle. She cooked my meal tonight. Thank you, Chef Noel. <laughs> um, there possibly could be a tip for you. Possibly. Probably not. Probably not. <laughs> 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 All right. I just put a combo of the pineapple, the pork belly, and the sweet and spicy sauce. And that, that's where it's at. That is a delicious combination.
That wraps up our trip to K-Pot in Orlando, Florida. I really enjoyed the grilling part of the experience, but not so much the hot pot. But Noelle likes the hot pot. I still don't know if I understand the concept of going to a restaurant and cooking your own food, but it is a unique experience, and I'd probably try it again. And remember, if you can imagine it, we can create it.